Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome to our Let's Play of RimWorld Royalty. Uh, today, this morning, Tynan Sylvester surprised everybody, if you haven't heard, with a, a, a new RimWorld DLC, which is kind of amazing that he and his, his team did this in secret, not telling anybody that they were working on, uh, on DLC, on, on an expansion. And this morning he was just like, yeah, this exists now. Uh, just a few days ago, he updated 1.1 and we thought, oh, cool. He's still updating the game. And then boom. Uh, yeah. Brand new expansion. It, it kind of looks like he took a lot of ideas from other mods. Mods. It almost looks like, like, uh, like Tynan Sylvester, the developer, like made a mod and made it official or something like that. Um, so, you know, we still have our RimWorld long play game going on. Uh, and we're kind of in the last leg of that. But I, I have to try this new expansion, so we're going to do it. I'm thinking this might be kind of a short-lived series, or, you know, we can kind of think about that that way. Um, that's right, we still have our Bionic Superhumans custom scenario. So the way, you know, uh, what this expansion adds... Mods. Cool, yeah, royalty. Royalty is added there. Look at that. Cool, cool, cool. Um, this adds a lot of stuff, including... Uh, I don't know, most stuff you'd find in Dwarf Fortress, like colonists can become... Oh, does it say here? Yes, the Empire has arrived. Their honor-bound culture wields hyper-advanced technology while bowing to the ancient traditions of kings, queens, titles, and honor. Earn royal titles, construct luxurious throne rooms and chambers, call imperial elite troops, and bond with unique imperial blade link weapons, use new psychic abilities... Uh, all kinds of things. Uh, new quest system, new mechanoids. Um, you don't have to serve the Empire. You can steal psychic amplifiers and other Imperial technology. The rebel life is free but challenging. Honestly, if I was doing a long series, that's what I would want to do. I would want to be like rebels against the Empire. But as it is, because we already have a long play going on and we just kind of want to try this, I'm thinking maybe we actually do something similar to the... Um, uh, to the bionic superhumans scenario that we did. And maybe we just do a custom scenario, like right out of the bat, a custom scenario. Let's see. Um, edit mode. Scenario editor. Uh, wait, I want a new one. Can I do a new one? Okay. Here we are. I've, I spent some time doing all this and it became really tedious, so I thought I'd just skip ahead here. Uh, I've called it Psychic Royalty. We're starting with one person chosen from 10, which is the best you can do. We're going to pick the best person we can get. Um, we're going to start with a learning assistant. I can't remember what that is. Uh, a psychic, a psi focus helmet, a link mono sword, uh, 10 vanometric power cells. And then, uh, oh wait, psi focus helmet is, is in here twice. Psi focus helmet, psychic amplifier. Do I even, I'm not sure what that is, but we're going to get one. A Psy-Focus robe, Psy-Focus shirt, Psy-Focus staff, Psy-Focus vest. Uh, I don't know if this is a weapon. We, maybe we'll use the monosword, maybe the staff, who knows. A, psy a bunch of Psy trainers, uh, one for everything available. For Beckon, Berserk Pulse, Berserk, Blinding Pulse, Burden, Chaos Skip, Entropy Link, Focus, Invisibility, Manhunter Pulse, Mass Chaos Skip, Pain Block, Skip, Smoke Pop, Stun, and Vertigo Pulse, and Wall Raise. One pet thrumbo, 20 package survival meals, 500 silver, and 500 steel. And that's it. I saved it. And we're going to see what this is like. This is a psychic royalty with a nice weapon. And we'll see what this is like. Um, no new narrators. I thought maybe this guy back here would be a new narrator, but I guess not. Uh, we'll do Randy just because I I love, I love Randy. He's my guy. Um, and we usually play Savage, and I think that's what we will play play for play with um yeah i think savage and let's see what this is like um oh i would do commitment mode but i don't trust it um we're, we're still gonna do you know basically commitment mode but i liked having multiple saves just for backups in case like, oh, I forgot, like I didn't press record and I'll have to reload it. So that's why we always do reload any time mode just for the channel. But we're not gonna, like if someone dies, I'm not gonna reload it. Seed is suffering, that sounds fine. I always do 100% globe coverage. Everything else is good. Generate. And uh, yeah, generating world. I'm very excited about seeing what this is all about. 
Oh man. Um, and I, I didn't want to, I know there are other, t- the two other weapons, the plasma blade or whatever, and then the Zeus hammer, but, um, let's just try one and we might not even use it because at C- I think we're going to be more of a psychic type here. And, uh, I'm excited about getting to like, uh, I don't know, just have one awesome colonist. Now, you know, it's we're not it's not like the bionic superhumans one where they're gonna have amazing um bodies or anything like that. We're still gonna have to be careful. We're just gonna see what this is like. But basically it's a raw brutality. Well, not raw brutality. We're starting with food and, and steel, but a single colonist. Alright, here's our world. This is fine. What are this? Oh, look at these. These are new Imperial sites. Imperium of Eternity is the faction. Trading here requires a title, knight or dame. Is there a capital? Is there a capital somewhere? Are there any other sites like that? Seems like there should be. Um, and maybe we'll play somewhere that I'm not that I've never played on before. Um, I don't know if there are new biomes. I don't think there are that wasn't advertised. Um, there are a couple of bog biomes that I've never played. So maybe that would be fun. Although it might also be good to like be near some of these Imperial sites. That might be cool. Um, maybe we can find both. Tropical Swamp. Um, there's like an Ice Bog, right? I've never played an Ice Bog. Although playing with one colonist, maybe that might be tricky. I think I have been in a swamp before. Oh, there's Temperate Swamp and Tropical Swamp. Um... Let's go north. I sheet. Where are those ice bogs? I know ice bogs are a thing. Huh. Tundra. Maybe this world is just too warm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing any ice bog. Oh, cold bog. There it is. That's what it looks like. Okay. Knowing that's what it looks like, a cold bog, I think we might do that. Um, it would be nice to be near an imperial place, though. There's a cold bog by a river. Is there a cold bog that has a road? Because I'd like to travel. Uh, maybe in the south. Let's try that. Oh, hello. Great. This isn't right on the road. We could also be on a river. Maybe here. Eh. Oh, wait. This is cold bog, isn't it? A river would be nice, but we have these vanometric power cells. Yeah, I think right here is going to be just fine. Uh, average temperature. Yeah, growing period's not great. I don't know if we're going to need to worry about food. It might be difficult, but um, that's okay. We're going to try it. Oh, since it's within four tiles of a faction base, they will feel you were encroaching. Ah, all right. Hold on. Maybe, maybe we will pick like here then. Is that all right? Yeah, that's okay. What was it? Four tiles, it said? Yeah, maybe we just need to be a little further back. Is this okay? No. Um. Huh. All right, hold on. Got to find the perfect place that doesn't exist. I do want to play Cold Bog. Okay, it's fine. Um, we don't need to be... What about right here? We don't need to be on a road. Great. Okay, what do we have? We need we need to find someone with good stats. Um, shooting. I, I w- I'm a little surprised that there's not like another, a new stat for like psychic power or something like that. Uh, ooh, bloodlust and greedy. Needs a really impressive bedroom. Your skills are awesome. You do have a gunshot though. Uh, asthma, no. Uh, you're not a psychopath. Pyromaniac, psychically hypersensitive, fast walker, stab scar. 
Hmm. Let's just start randomizing. Okay. Nimble. We want skills. Careful shooter, fast learner. We might have a winner here. You can cook. Your construction's not wonderful, but you're a fast learner, so that helps everything, right? Global learning factor. And a careful shooter. You have a wife and a father-in-law. Uh, Hook Happy Gerador. Okay. Musical kid, inventor. Good at crafting, good at artistic. I like you. Um, yeah. Done. Happy. Happy the inventor. All right, happy. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, generating our cold bog map. What are these pants? It looks like these are like holes going into his pants that like you can see inside. Maybe that is what they are. That's weird. What's your deal, dude? And what is this, this mask you're wearing? What is this in your hair? The three of you three. Oh, I guess I didn't change that beginning text. Um, yeah, we can just ignore that. Okay. Titian is our, uh, our thrumbo. Let's get started here. So the side trainers look just like neuro trainers. Uh, we're going to want to get all of this inside. Um, actually, we can just use them, right? Happy? Requires psychic amplifier. Oh, well, that's the one thing that we did bring was a psychic, am psychic amplifier, wasn't it? Um, somewhere here. Let's uh, claim all this or un unforbid it. Where's unforbid? Allow. Okay. Not connected to power. Oh, I thought those made power. Uh, I guess I was wrong about that. Um, all right, start putting on this stuff. Will you just start putting it on? Wear that. Wear that. Wear are all these things? Learning assistant. Oh, I need. That's something you have to install. Uh, have some installed in you. There's the psychic amplifier. According to the laws of Imperium of Eternity, one must have the title of Yuman to legally use a psychic amplifier. Each time Happy performs a psychast above the allowed level, there's a chance of uh, a chance Imperium of Eternity will detect its psychic signature. This will lead to diplomatic consequences. A psychic silencer implant would allow the use of psychic amplifier without detection. But we have to install it. We have to. Oh, look at that weapon. Okay. And we're going to learn all these things. I guess we're going to be a bit rebellious here. Level, we're learning level one on all these things. Yeah, this doesn't take too long. All right. So what's going on here? Oh, look at all these abilities. Berserk level five. Oh, the more you learn level one. Huh. Are the ones you're learning later a higher levels? That's what it seems like. So some of these are just level one, and then as we learn them, we get more and more psychic ability to and and get better at it. Where that? Um, I guess equip that mono sword. Oh, one must have the title of knight to legally use a terror bender. Link mono sword. Hold on, let's take a look at this thing. It has a name, and its name is Terror Bender. A crystal metallic longsword infused with mechanites that maintain a monomolecular cutting edge. It cuts through even thick armor with ease with its lightweight and onboard persona. Uh, while its lightweight and onboard persona permit extremely fast attacks, the weapon has an onboard persona that can bond only to a single person. The wielder and intelligent weapon can synchronize their reflexes and attack with frightening speed, accuracy, and creativity. Once bonded to a wielder, the weapon's persona will refuse to be wielded by anyone else. What about this guy? Can we just equip that? We can. Okay. Um, and is that your weapon? Yeah. 
an ultralight tech staff threaded with the psychic focusing materials. Uh, though it's relatively ineffective as a weapon, a psychaster wielding this will have greater psychic sensitivity and will dissipate psychic entropy faster. That market value is a thousand. This one is three thousand. Oh, that link mono sword. Okay, let's build ourselves a little base, I guess. Um, and I guess right where we're standing is fine. Let's chop some wood, I guess. Or make some out of steel? Let's chop some wood. Um, look at these cypress trees. They look... Uh, I'm not used to seeing these. These might be in the, uh, the game that we're used to seeing. This is taking a while. Um, and our... Thrumbo, we need to train you to haul. Train you for all the things. We're gonna need food. And I didn't bring a gun. Um, so we probably will need to use that sword to kill animals and cook them. Yeah. Alright, we have a little wood. I could just use steel, but I think we might want that. Uh, where can we... Oh, this is all, um, marshy soil. I see. Yeah, the cold biome is a little difficult to build on. That's okay. We don't need a lot. Let's just make a little room here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Uh, and we'll need a door. Just something. It'll take a little bit of wood. Uh, but we've got plenty of meals to start with. And there are plenty of trees for the thrombo to eat. Happy. And let's, let's take a look at these clothes that we have on. So the Psyfocus helmet... A lightweight helmet designed for psychic focusing. It provides little protection, but yeah, it's all the same thing. It enhances psychic sensitivity and dissipates psychic entropy. All of that stuff. I didn't get any um, special pants for... Oh, that shirt. We got to wear that. Okay. And these power cells... What do these do? They do generate free energy forever without using fuel. That's what I thought. Great. We'll need to install those. Excellent. We are we are a happy psychic warrior here. Yeah, let's uh let's we gotta put all this stuff away, you know. Alright, our construction's good enough for walls. And we are a fast learner, so it goes up fast. Yeah, chop it down. We want to get indoors. I don't know how much, like, psychic... I mean, once we link to this terror bender, which we might have to... Actually, I don't know. Maybe we can kill animals with psychic power. Also, does this... De this is deteriorating. Um, and I don't like that. I mean, we'll get it... I wonder if you can repair stuff now. That would be awesome. If you can repair items, that would be a very welcome addition. Move a Titian. We're probably going to die pretty quickly, but that's okay. That'll be worth it. Uh, we never actually looked at, like, your needs. How are you? Low expectations. Yeah, you're fine. Right, the psychic amplifier. I didn't realize that we, we didn't need a doctor to install that. I wonder if there were other things that we could just install. Can I just install this learning assistant? No. Uh, where did you go? Going for a walk. Oh, you need some recreation. Okay. Uh, oh, you need more wood. Okay. Fine. Chop that one down. Yeah, you don't need that walk right now. Let's get everything indoors. Um, does that increase your plant skill? It does. 
Nice. Air plant, plant skill is decent. So how do we use these psychic powers? Smoke pop, entropy gain, casting time. Berserk pulse, generate an overwhelming rush of undetected rage. Mass chaos skip, skip everyone near a target point to a random location nearby. Oh, that is cool. All right, we're roofing this up and then we're going to um, get a stockpile zone in here. We'll just put everything back here. And we can probably just install these outside, I think. Maybe three of them for to start. Hello, Thrimbo. All right, we have a little house. Nice. We have power. Uh, let's move that sword in first now, please. Great. All right. Um, and we should make a bed. First, we'll put in a sleeping spot. Look, Grand Throne. 75 gold, 300 steel. Pretty awesome. Drapes. Braziers. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna be a psychic king. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, okay. Let's, let's make a real bed. If we can. 45 wood. We don't have the wood right now, but we'll get it. Uh, uh looks for any trees that are, oh, that one's fully grown. Great. I uh, you might as well haul, uh, yeah, chop that tree down. Fine. Okay. Psychic Entropy. It, tells, it has a meter here. Fail rate. It increases after performing a Psycast. All right, so what else do we have? Burden. It slows the target. Uh, pain Block. Blocks pain. Stun. That's cool. Prevents movement. Entropy Link. Uh, interesting. Shares Entropy. Binding pulse. Induce noise in the visual centers of the brain, obscuring vision of everyone. Okay. Chaos skip. Transports. Beckon. Commands the target to approach the caster. Vertical pulse. Spatial orientation sense of everyone near the target point. Um, flesh creatures will become extremely nauseous. Focus. Boosts the target's sight, hearing, and moving cap uh, capacities. Because we could use that on ourselves to focus. Wall rays form a temporary wall by skipping rubble and soil up from deep under the ground. Skip is teleport. Smoke pop, smoke pop. Invisibility? Wow. It lasts for 15 seconds. And berserk, causing them to attack anyone nearby. Manhunter pulse. So like, berserk pulse sounds like uh, it should be easy for us to take out a whole thing of bandits, for example. But none of these just do straight damage. Um, still, like, if we wanted to go hunting, we could, like, stun... Yeah, we could stun an animal and then kill it with our mono monosword. Uh, how's the bed? It's an awful bed, but it's better than nothing. Uh, I guess we can get a lamp, right? Get a lamp. Okay. Um, and it is cold. We should probably get a heater as well. Yeah. That was close enough, right? Yeah. We have a lot of power. We have more power than we know what to do with. These things probably cost a lot of money, and it's probably increasing our colony wealth way too much. We're probably going to be attacked really early by a giant swarm of things because our colony wealth is starting very high and we're even though we're only one colonist okay all right happy's up eating some food nice we got light how you doing how's your needs awful barrack yeah and you slept in the cold we're fixing it 
Oh, you're hauling everything, huh? Oh, we don't have components. We need components. Fair. Uh, any components down here? Yes. Let's get a component to start. Exotic goods trader from Concord of and my and my mi 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 Mindler Mindler. Uh, and ex uh, they will hang around the colony. You can attack them, but this will anger them. All right, cool. Welcome. What do y'all have? What do you have to sell us? Telescope, psychic soothe, pulser. Uh, we could sell you something. We could sell you the uh, the thing that we have to install medically that we can't use, you know? You're meditating. Cool. Yeah, we should make a horseshoe pin. In the mud is fine. Oh, I can't build it in the mud. Uh, what about... Yeah, in this area. Sure. I'll just chop down a tree, but that's okay. Um, I I am tempted to just take that terror bender. I like having the psychic thing we have, the uh, the rod. How much damage does it do? Um. Yeah, very little. 2.8 DPS. Where are you go? Oh, right. You're getting a component. Fair. Cold bog. It's a nice biome, actually. It sounds terrible, but it's it's nice. How's your mining? Uh, yeah, you don't have any um, passion for it, but that's okay. Here, yeah, we're going to need a research bench, all the things. If we get that far. <laughs> we'll see how far we get with one colonist. Super colonist, but one colonist nonetheless. All right, let's get that heater, and then we can uh, trade. Why do you have your guns out? Makes me nervous. Also, what's our social skill? One. Yeah, okay. Uh, oh, right. We could sell you some Vanometric Power Cells, I guess. True. We'll sell you the Learning Assistant. Uh, nice as it is. It strengthens the formation of new memories. I mean, that would be cool to install, but we can't install it yet. A Nuclear Stomach. Uh, food is required only to replace matter lost from the body. It cannot get food poisoning. But there's little room to shield the reactor, so the radiation increases the risk of cancer. Yeah, I would think so. An elbow blade? Uh, wow. A razor-sharp blade that extends at will from a hidden opening at the end of the ulna, appearing without warning can be used for devastating attacks, and a hand talon. It's kind of the similar thing. Very cool. More psychic trainers, psy trainers. Wow. I should have gotten more neuro trainers to be a, a super colonist. Guinea pigs. Um, do I sell you anything? Uh, it would be nice to have a TV. A mega screen television. We can't afford it, right? Not without selling Titian. I mean, I could sell you some of these vanometric power cells, but they're wor not worth as much as I would have thought. Well, I guess the, the item sell price modifier, yeah. I'd have to sell a bunch to get the mega screen. Yeah, I think we're okay, actually. So we'll we'll sell you this and get some uh, silver for that. I mean, I do want it, but we, we can't install it in ourselves, is the thing. Anything else? I get some Glitter World meds. I think we're okay. I could get another side trainer. You know what? I might want a melee neuro trainer, actually. Yeah, I'll trade you one of these for that. Uh, where is it? Oh, you, you, you have it. Great. Use it. No, no, I didn't mean that. Learn melee. Uh, relations increased. 
Level four to level 10. We are now much better at melee. Worth it. Can we build that? Finish building that? Oh, construction skill too low. What do we need? Um, five. Okay, we can get there. Um, we should put a cut in here. Uh, this is a good start. Um, again, I don't think the series will last too long, but I'm glad we're kind of playing with some of the stuff. Um, and you know what? I should probably use some of our psychic powers before we end. I can't end this episode without using any. Let's hunt this rat. Let's let's uh, let's grab this neuro train this uh, weapon. Yeah, just equip it. Nice. And oh, look at this menu. Oh, do we not have psychic entropy went down when we're not holding the thing. Uh, let's stun. It's illegal. Use it on the rat. Oh, cool. Sweet. What is our, um, DPS with this thing? Oh my gosh. 23.74. Wow. That is amazing. That is freaking amazing. Of course, we, we have barely any armor, but we have all these psychic things. We have psychic entropy here. It goes, goes down over time. Yes. They're all illegal for me to use. That is awesome. All right, we're going to put a cut in there. I really enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.